Away down east in Maine, lovely white and green villages nestling among the pines and birches. A hardy, lovable people, canny to some, wise and understanding to others. Ethan Whittier was canny, but then there were times when to his wife, he was just plain dumb. But you are, Ethan. There are times when you're just plain dumb. Now, Marthy, don't you go saying that. It's true, Ethan, and this is one of those times. Now, you're not going down there to New York and go interfering in Louise's and Henry's affairs. Well, I ain't letting no man make Louise unhappy, I ain't, Marthy. I don't care if he is a husband. Well, by quickie, if Henry's running around with some other woman, I tell you I'm going to stop him. You're going to make a fool out of yourself, that's what you're going to do. Yeah. Didn't nobody make a fool out of me the last time I went to New York, did they? Hmm? Well, at any rate, I tell it I'll be going to New York just the same. Dumb or not dumb. Yes, sir, Marty. <laughs> have another one of them cigars handy, would you, Henry? Oh, well, why, yes, sir. Uh, have one. Uh, thank you, Henry. Thanks. Uh, <clears throat> well, now, what's been the matter, Henry? They taking your money away from you down there on Wall Street? No. As a matter of fact, they've been doing very well. You don't say so. Well, Henry, that's a mighty pretty girl, my daughter. That's right, sir. Yep. Fine girl. Yes, sir, fine girl. And, Henry, I, I always said that I'd see to it that she'd be happy. You don't think she is? <clears throat> Henry, I'm going to talk to you just like, well, just like you was a real son of mine. There ain't no other girl, is there, Henry? There couldn't be any other. Well, then, what's the matter? Oh, oh, come in, Louise. Hello, Father. We'll have dinner very soon now. Are you hungry? Well, I can always eat. Well, if, uh, if you'll excuse me, I think I'll go and clean up a bit. Yes, Henry. Well, now, now what's the matter, Louise? Oh, he doesn't love me anymore, Father. Oh, here, here, here. <laughs> You come sit in your old pa's lap like you used to. Oh, come on. That's it. Now, what's the trouble? Oh, I don't know if I did. Oh, oh Father, I, I can't go on like this. I can't. No. No. <laughs> well, I don't think you will. I try so hard to make him happy. Yeah. And tomorrow you're both going to be happy. Father. You know, your mother, Louise, she thinks I'm dumb. But she's wrong. <laughs> So, don't you never tell me again that I'm dumb, Marthy. But what was the trouble, he said? Well, it wasn't no other girl, Marthy. Well, will you stop telling me what it ain't and tell me what it is? I'm coming to that. But they're happy now, I can tell you that. Ethan, with you, if you don't tell me what now, it is. Now, 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 calm yourself, Marthy. Why, just as soon as Louise come over and sat on my lap and buried her head on my shoulder, well, it didn't take any second sight to know what was the trouble. Ethan, whatever do you mean? I don't mean nothing more nor less than just plain B.O. Yeah, that daughter of ours, she'd filled a bathroom up with a lot of fancy perfume soaps that ain't worth a dime a dozen, and not a cake of life boy in the place for all her bringing up. Well, I never. Yeah, so I just put plenty of life boy there, and I give her a good talking to. Yes, sir. So don't you never go calling me dumb again, Marty. Ethan? All right, Marty. Away down east in Maine where the cool breezes blow. That's where we'd all like to be on hot summer days. But surely the next best cooler off to a Maine breeze is a life boy bath. Won't any soap do the same, you ask? No, sir. A bath doesn't seem a bath to me without Life Boy. Its lather seems to go right down into pores and leaves you feeling clean as a whistle. Boy, how a Life Boy bath peps you up after a long, hot day. And I couldn't get along without Life Boy. Before we were married, my husband said a lot of pretty things about my being dainty as a flower. Believe me, I try to live up to that reputation. That means extra care these hot days and plenty of baths with Life Boy to keep B.O. away. Life Boy is wonderful for the complexion, too. And so it goes. For glorious comfort, for sure protection against B.O., you need Life Boy. Why not get some this very day? 